Melania and I are honored to welcome you to the White House and to wish all of you a very, very happy Hanukkah. God, and to always celebrate the extraordinary gifts that the Jewish people have given to America and to the world. Tonight, we are especially grateful to be joined by the Pollock family, who lost their beloved daughter, Meadow, in a horrific Parkland shooting earlier this year. I've gotten to know him, and he's a great, great gentleman. $400,000. We used Jerusalem Stone, which, if you're in the real estate business, you Our thoughts also turn to the victims and survivors of the anti-Semitic attack on the Tree of Life Synagogue in Pittsburgh. I was there, and it was horrible, and the rabbi was great. He was a tremendous gentleman. In the wake of these evil murders, Americans of all backgrounds have come together to express our unwavering determination to extract the vile poison of anti-Semitism from our world. It's Andrew Pollack. Andrew? Mr. President, despite the pundits and so-called experts who said you couldn't, you have retaken Washington for the American people. You are the greatest friend that the Jewish people have ever had in the White House. Not only because you recognize Jerusalem as the capital of Israel and followed through on your promise to move the embassy to Jerusalem, but because you understand the spirit of Hanukkah within your heart. You're a fighter, and you understand that in order for America to survive, we have to keep on winning. Asher kidishanu b'mitzvosav v'tzivanu hadlikenecha